Hey, look, it's another P.O. Box video, but before that, uh, just your friendly reminder that Masterpiece Movie Optimus Prime is still one of my favorite things ever. I just leave them on the desk at this point. I just I don't even have them on the shelf anymore. I just leave them on the desk, and I mess with them every time I come in here because he's one of my favorite things I've ever owned ever. Anyways, i got a package here, and I've got a letter. Um, I just opened it up, and I just have it facing the other way so I don't have to worry about the address. But yeah, i got some stuff here. I'm excited to show you. Um, I went to the post office and got this letter a few days ago, and I always check the post office on Thursdays, so I went back, checked, and I had the package. So let's go ahead and slip everything out of here. I'm hoping I'm not ruining anything. There's a lot of paper. Well, oh my gosh, there's a lot of paper. Okay, that's, that's everything in there. Alrighty. Please use this envelope to mail the logo drawing back to me. Thank you. Oh, you want it back? Oh, I like these little drawings. Um, but yeah, look at that. Oh, that's cool. Thank you so much. So this is the envelope to send it back. The other side of it has part of the address, so I had to jump cut. Um, but yeah, I will send that back to you, my man. I will throw... Is that a cat? Cat's freaking running around. Oh my gosh. Anyways, I will mail that back to you. I'll throw a stamp on it, no problem. Um, anyways, let's read this note. 9-17-19. Oh my. Dear JCC1004. Oh, wrong channel. Oh well. Shucks. That's kind of funny since if you if you listen to my podcast, my brother starts off by saying, hey, he calls himself 2224 instead of 1004. He just had a brain fart. Hey, JCC, I have uh, enclosed two drawings. So the drawing of the clone troopers is for you. Would you please sign your logo drawing and return it to me? Will do. It would mean a lot to me. I'm sorry I didn't send you any clone troopers. Oh, man, it's no problem. You don't have to. You know, No one has to ever send me anything. I love any mail I get. Um... You only have four. That's that's awesome, man. Which ones do you have? Uh, oh, you answer it. <laughs> the clones I have are from the Clone Wars and Revenge of the Sith. I have Clone Wars Phase 1, 212. That's an awesome one. Commander Devis, a.k.a. Captain Killshot's cousin. Clone Wars Arf Trooper. That's a really good one. 91st Recon Corps Trooper, not the Intendable. That's still... You have some pretty good ones, man. Um, your, vi your video... I'm just realizing how I have my arm propped up like this. It's funny. Uh, you can't see it, though. Your videos are awesome, and I love all your P.O. Box openings. I just wanted to send you a letter and say hello, and thank you for your videos. Have a gr great day. Lucas, 13 years old, Miami, Florida. Thank you so much, Lucas. I really appreciate it. Anyways, let's look at your other drawing. Because um, I have... Okay. This is one. You can keep this. These are the troopers I own. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's such a cool picture, man. I love it. Oh, it's such a nice little collection. I, I really love that group. It's like a nice little squad. Oh, I love it. That's the um, that's the four-pack 212. That's not the one that was single-carded. That's actually a pretty cool version of that. And the Arv Trooper, man, that's a really nice one. Man, you just, and they're not yellowed either. Oh, dude, I love your collection. Because, um, see, a collection doesn't have to be massive for it to be good. It, it just has to be appreciated and nice. Okay, well, oh man, you got my three favorites. Captain Killshot, my boy, Commander Cody, and the Bark Trooper. Man, why do I love that Bark Trooper so much? I have no idea. But yeah, man, look at that. That is sweet. Thank you so much, Lucas. I love it. Ah, oh, definitely going to add that to my ever-growing wall of fan art. Oh, I, I might. I should probably take a picture of that and show it off because it's pretty impressive, man. So yeah, there's that letter from Lucas. Thank you so much, dude. And then we have this this package here um who was it from i'm just peeking it was from uh did i cut who it's from like a dummy dumb i cut your name in half dude i'm sorry <laughs> hopefully your letter may reveal who you are dear gcc2224 i have sent you random things that you might like and some customs that i made and some more random stuff i hope you enjoy clone stormtrooper don't judge Ooh. Alrighty, so I cut your name in half. I, I'm sorry. Um, but let's see what's in here. I love these kind of boxes. Just the random stuff. Never go, you know, get, bleh, bleh, bleh. You never know what you're going to get. Uh, this is actually really cool. Um, I've actually always been wanting one of the 2007? Um, here, does it have the date on it? Oh, it's kind of hard to read. Uh, it doesn't have its belt, but I've always wanted the 2000, one of the 2007 Turtles, one of the proper figures. And hey, it's Leo. I actually have a little bit of a Leo collection. So I'll be on the lookout for his belt. And hopefully add him to my collection. And here we got... Ooh! Power Rangers fans will instantly know who it is. Uh, I will not, though, because I'm not into Power Rangers like that. Um, really cool guy, though. Oh, man. I, I'm actually I'm actually kind of a big fan of, like, the weird villains in Power Rangers. I don't know why. 
but they're cool. Anyways, there's that guy. And we just have a bag here. And then we have... Ooh, we got stuff. Ooh, who's this? Oh, dude. Who is... Is this a... Dude, I'm... I'm this looks very Ninja Turtle-y. I am not... It says Mirage Studio. Yeah, Mirage Studios Playmates Toys. I have not seen this character before. This ant character? I have no idea who it is. Oh my gosh, it is sweet! Oh, I love him! I need to look into who that is. I have never seen this Ninja Turtle character before, so that is awesome, man. Thank you so much. I will have to look into who that is. Ah, yes! Mondo Gecko! <laughs> I know this one. Dude! Ah, oh, Retro TMNT, I love it so much. Man, Playmates had amazing sculpts. Look at that. Ah, oh, I love it. Ah, oh, dude, thank you so much. Okay, what else we got? Hopefully it's more TMNT. Um, well, we got a Skylanders guy. Skylanders was definitely beyond my time, but they're cool, though. I see the appeal for sure. They're kind of cool looking. Um, what else we got? We got hero, some Hero Mashers Anakin pieces. Um, that's, that's interesting. I might donate those to my brother so he can make more Eldritch Abominations. Here we have a thing. Um, kind of cool. Very ball joint heavy. Kind of like has a cockpit or something. Hmm. I'm going to have to look into what that is. But I like it. I like it. It feels nice in the hands. It's another bed. No way, dude. That's so okay. Anyways, continuing on. We have... Oh, dude, this is sweet. I've actually always wanted one of these uh, Owens from Jurassic World. That's so cool. Thanks so much, man. I've always been wanting one of those. Oh, man, I gotta admit, they did a pretty good job on Chris Pratt's uh, likeness there. It's really nice. Um, but yeah, man, I really dig that. This, though, you did not... did not have to do this. Because I, I already have the Walmart reissue. I think this is another version of the Walmart reissue. But, man, you did not have to do this. This is sweet. Uh, hopefully you got it on clearance or something. Um... I might pass this on, might pass it along. Uh, I might keep it though, just to have in a second Hot Rod, because Hot Rod is my favorite Autobot character. Oh man, thank you so much, I love that. Uh, I saw another Transformery guy in here. Um, this is another one I already have, but I'll never say no to an Optimus Prime. We can look at that, nice little Optimus. That's uh, from Robots in Disguise, a little Legion class. Alrighty, let's get this moving along. Ooh, dude! Dude, look at this! Oh my gosh! Man! Oh man, this is a Marvel Select! Amazing Spider-Man 2 Spider-Man! No, man, you don't have to do this. Oh man, that is sweet looking. Look at that. Oh wow. Man, can you tell I'm someone who's really easily impressed by plastic, uh, by plastic toys? <laughs> Dude, this thing's sweet! Oh, thank you so much. You're going to have to let me know who you are, for sure, because I cut your name in half on the box, and I'm so sorry. <laughs> Please let me know in the comments who you are. Um, here's another bag. I'm requiring quite a bit of bags here, but hey, this is what I use to pack my boxes, so I thank you greatly. You're, you're, you know, you're doing it right. And here we have more Hero Mashers Eldritch Abomination parts. He, he, had, he was holding a lightsaber. It fell out of his hand. But yeah, it's like parts of a stormtrooper. I don't have many hero mashers. Uh, I, was, I was bashing on him in the podcast I did. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Maybe give that a listen. Um, so, yeah, I, I like having some parts, but I'll probably just give them to my brother so he can do weird stuff if he wants. Okay, what else we got? We got a stormtrooper rifle. It's cool. E11, technically. I saw this. And I was like, no way. Then I got distracted with the Spider-Man. Thankfully, I caught when my audio cut out because I hate when it does that. But anyways, I don't have this one. Oh my gosh, I, I saw this and I got distracted by this freaking Spider-Man here. Man, look at this. You did not have to. This guy is awesome. Why did I not get him? Man, he is sweet. Because I have some symbiote stuff. I don't go after all the symbiotes, but... This is, oh, oh man, this is a juicy box. This is really juicy. Oh, dude, this is so sweet. Dude, this is one that I was really gonna get, right? I had every intention to buy it, and I never did. And here he is, little, little bludgeon, like the pretender. Oh my gosh, these things are so cool. It's like a, it's like a pretender, a headmaster, or like a, it's like a pretender, a power master, and a target master all in one. It's crazy. Yeah, it's a little bludgeon, man. That's so sweet. Man, you don't... Oh, my gosh. I'm getting spoiled over here. 
Oh, dude. It's an OG Kylo. This is an OG Kylo. Oh, man. It's one of my favorite figures of all time, right? Because um, I am so nostalgic over the Force Friday thing. Hey, by the way, this video is probably going to go out um, a little before Force Friday. So that's epic. I can't wait. But yeah, look at this. Ooh, man, that is sweet. I'm I'm probably just going to hold on to this because it's one of my favorite figures. Um, I might just want to keep a duplicate of that. Ooh, Power Rangers. It's a gold ranger. This is Dino Charge, right? Is it? Is it like a gold? Dude, he looks sweet. Oh, man, I love that. It's like, I, people were like, why do you like the, you know, the Bandai Legacy collection instead of the Lightning collection? Because I like my Power Rangers looking all big and beefy. Because I only have grown up with the toys. I never watched the show. Because the show was dumb. There's another bag. Here we have a Stormtrooper leg. Maybe if the helmet's in here, that would be sweet. Um, ooh, Bionicle or Hero Factory. Character, character and creature building system pots. Oh, look, his head is a hand. Look at that. That's hilarious. We have, ooh. Well, this is like another one of those ball jointy guys. Sort of. I don't know. I really need to look into what these are. I really like it. Unfortunately, this guy's broken and missing stuff. But still, I I, I like looking into new weird toy lines. But yeah, there's some more um, Bionicle parts. I'm just going to call it Bionicle to keep it simple. This is what you were talking about. I remember seeing your message saying you're sending Lego minifigures. I remember seeing that, but I don't remember your username. Dude, hopefully, is the leg in here? I don't know if the leg's in here. Oh, but his leg, well, he's got some parts. He's got a leg and um, a thing, maybe another piece of his leg. But unfortunately, it looks like, ah, oh, Slash is missing a leg. That's That stinks, because I don't have Slash. I have um, the repaint, but I don't have Slash. So I'll definitely keep this around if I ever find another beater Slash, maybe with a leg. Hey, it's Squirtle! Did you know that Squirtle was, like, my favorite Pokemon just because that little Squirtle thing? I'm gonna... I really like that. I like having a physical Squirtle item now. Thank you. Um, <laughs> alrighty. Man, this box has been amazing, and I haven't even looked at the Lego yet. And here we have a little... Ooh, Star Wars car. It's like a Jedi car. Wow. Wow! I like that. Then we have a little, uh... Uh, Bendy and the Ink Machine, I'm gonna say. Yeah, Bendy and the Inca Machine. I watched Markiplier play, like, the first episode of that. And I'm like, eh, it's neat. But I didn't really follow up on it. So there's the box all done. Now we just have the Lego. All in this nice little bag and some other smaller items. Let's bend the camera down so we can actually take a closer look. See, I'm seeing some random little Lego components and things. We have here... Uh, some Boba Fett pieces, and here, let's actually zoom in. Some Boba Fett pieces, that little pistol I like. Actually, is this a Boba Fett version? Oh, he's got a black head. But yeah, that's that's neat. Um, I do have this newer helmet version of Boba Fett. Uh, oh, is that, is that supposed to be like the Mandalorian? Dude, I think, I think did you make a Mandalorian custom? Because if so, it's really cool. Um, I think they're doing an official minifig of that. Ooh, got one of these guys. Um, he's got different hand colors, but you know what? I'm pretty sure... And I saw his helmet. I'm pretty sure I probably have a minifig spare with, like, the proper hands. So I'll probably just give him normal black hands and he'll be on his merry way onto my shelf. And here we have... It's like a hover tank driver with a head there. Let's give him this helmet. Oh, that's a Rebel's helmet. Yeah, it's cool, man. I like these parts if I ever want to use them. I don't do a lot with Lego nowadays, though. Oh, look, it's that Jack guy. Oh, man, he's definitely been played with. Man, he has been... I want to know the story behind this minifig, because he has definitely been on a lot of adventures. And he should have the... Oh, he's a key... Is he a keychain? Or did you glue the... I Did you glue the head? I don't know. Because the, the helmet's attached to the head. I don't know if there was like a weird release of him where they did that. Um, and then here we have... Heavily customized... Uh, looking like a... I don't know... It's heavily customized, I can tell you that. Then here we have... Oh, here's the hover tank helmet. These are like a ragtag group of guys. I dig it. And Ooh, we have a lot of guns here. Look at that. Well, that is sweet, man. Thanks. A lot of nice guns for three and a quarter in Star Wars. Is that the thing that came with... Is that the gun that came with the Mimbin Trooper? I don't remember specifically. I always record these so late at night, I can never remember. Here we have some droid pieces. Which I can actually always use some spare droid pieces. Here we have, oh look, 
It's a Mimbin. Aw. Poor Mimbin head. What has happened to him? My poor boy. And we have some more cars. We just have this snazzy looking hot, hot wheel here. Kind of angry looking like a dragon. Oh, same old. Same old, just different deco. I like that. And then we have this piece, this component right here, which I enjoy. And then we have, ooh, almost missed this. Republic Trooper helmet. That's sweet. And then we have, this is awesome. He's got a police vest on, but take that off. And I have myself a Lego MCU Spider-Man. Dude, that's sweet. I don't have a Lego MCU Spider-Man. Now I do. Oh, it's awesome, man. I love it. He's got arm printing. Oh my gosh. That's crazy, man. I didn't know they did arm printing on MCU Spidey. Yeah, he's real, too. <laughs> I'm just so used to looking on the neck peg. You can tell a Lego minifig's real or fake right off the bat if you look on the peg right there. It says Lego, right? So it's real. But if it doesn't say Lego, it is fake, my friend. Um, you can also kind of just tell sometimes. So, oh, there's another rifle. So I guess you just got a lot of Mimbin Troopers on clearance or something. You didn't want those rifles. Hey, I will take them. I will take them, man. So, this box has been amazing. You're, you're way too kind. Um, got a Kylo here. Let's not forget him. The winner of the box, in my opinion. Or the winners. Man, there's so many good things. Uh, and then the Spider-Man is way cooler than I ever expected a Marvel Select to be. Because I don't really do a lot of Marvel Select, but this Spidey is amazing. And then, do, let's not forget these awesome TMNT guys. Oh, man, they're so sweet. Where'd Mondo go? There's Mondo. Alrighty, man. Oh, dude, so awesome. And then the hot... Whoop! I almost spilled my water. Then this hot rod, man. You can see <laughs> the hot rod's dripping water because I almost spilled it. Oh, man, you did not have to. Oh, no! No! The water spilled on this. Oh, man. Oh, that stinks. Did he get on your art? You see, I always leave a cup of water here if my throat's getting sore. But I, my throat didn't get sore. Oh, man, I hope I didn't. Oh, I'm worried now. Where's your art? Where's your art? Where's your art? Okay, it, it got a little bit. That should dry off okay. Didn't get on the actual art. Man, that stinks. Ah, water. Get out of here. I hate it. Oh, man, why did I get so dirty? It's probably all the ink. The ink, that's why. Man, I feel bad now. Aw. Oh. Anyways, let's get on a lighter note. And let's say thank you to everybody who sends me stuff I don't deserve. Uh, I really appreciate it, man. I really do. Awesome stuff every time. Uh, here, let's let's get that art in here because I want to. I really like this art. It's my three boys. It's my three boys. Of course I like it. There we go. Thank you so much, guys. I'll be sure to get that back to you, Lucas. Uh, that's I didn't ruin that, did I? Okay, good. That was somewhere else. Alrighty. I'll get that back to you, Lucas. Thank you so much, package person. Alrighty, guys. Thank you so much. If you want to send anything in the P.O. box and you never have to be super generous or anything, here is the address. Feel free to send me anything you wish. I will never ask you for anything. I love it, man. I... I appreciate it. And you guys love watching these videos, too. Yeah, Apparently, you guys do. So I'm going to keep making them as long as I keep getting packages. I love you guys. I really appreciate you. This was an awesome, awesome unboxing. I love you guys. And uh, what time is it? It is 10 o'clock. Oh, should probably just get to bed soon. I'm really tired. Goodbye.